First on Fox, we begin with breaking news. A person is shot and killed late this afternoon in the heart of a busy downtown St. Louis at 7th and Market Street in Keener Plaza. Our crews nearby heard the gunshots. This is a very active scene right now. And Fox 2's Jordan Williams joins us now live with what we know so far. Jordan. A man is shot and killed here at Keener Plaza in downtown St. Louis. We have Inus. Oof. Three, two, three. Well, we are having some uh, audio difficulties right now with Jordan, but you are looking at video from the scene right now. This is at 7th and Market around 3 o'clock, 3.30 this afternoon. We got reports that a person had been shot. We have confirmed that one person was shot and killed there. Uh, and we are waiting for police to bring us an update. We know police are going through nearby buildings. This is very close to Ballpark Village, right across from the old Mike Shannon's. We have Stan David live in Bomarito Automotive Group Skyfox over the scene right now. What can you tell us, Stan? with Stan again. Stan, can you hear us live from Bomberito Automotive Group Skyfox? Uh, well, Mandy, I, I'm having trouble hearing you up here. We got a lot of radio traffic, but I uh, can tell you this is the west side of Keener Plaza at Market 7th. As you've mentioned, this is that corridor that many city officials have been wanting to build outward from the arch out to, uh, you know, revitalize the area. I'm going to show you something here that's very interesting. I'm backing out and be patient with me. This is a good block away is Ballpark Village and Bush Stadium. And the PWC building, as I'm zooming in, is right here where we have one of our bureaus for Fox 2. Now, I'm zooming in and I'm going to put in our digital zoom to give you a little better look, but we have found that gunshot hit a window on what appears to be the top floor. If you can see that window there in the middle of uh, your screen. Now that is a good block, almost block and a half from the scene at Keener Plaza. So uh, this is kind of the dangerous things that do go on with this kind of violence and this kind of gunplay. I'll zoom out again and show you the distance uh, from the initial scene. I can tell you that the uh, victim is behind that tree there at the bottom of my screen. And obviously, decorum tells us we'll uh, keep the camera back. So uh, that's basically what we've got so far, Bandy. Obviously, any updates, we'll bring them to you. All right, Stan, thank you. Let's go live now where police are updating reporters and our crew there on the scene. And let's listen in. at 7th and Market in Keener Plaza. Uh, have described that the uh, victim here in the were, um, and then the suspect started firing shots at the victim. Um, this was around the corner from where the, the body was found. Uh, the victim then ran over to the front of Keener Plaza at 7th and Market where he collapsed and the suspect fired more shots at him. Um, suspect fled. Uh, he is still at large. Do you know who that suspect is? No, we don't at this time. We're reviewing surveillance footage uh, to see if we can, and if any cameras captured the actual incident, and we're going to see if we can try to locate the suspect on the uh, footage. After, of course. All right, we're looking at more live pictures right now from Bomarito Automotive Group Skyfox. Just to recap what we know from police that one person was shot not far from the scene, then ran to Keener Plaza at 7th and Market where that person collapsed and died. Uh, police just saying that uh, there were additional shots fired at Keener Plaza. We're trying to find out exactly what led up to this shooting, but again, one person dead there. We'll continue to follow this breaking news and get more information and update you throughout this newscast.